Welcome to Reality Business. As a financial advisor, I'm often asked, how do I make more money? How do I get more income into my organization or into my household? Well, Mr. Hubbard gave us a very specific datum on how to determine exactly how much income we're going to get in our lifetimes. And he says the income potential of any usual group is established by the demand for income, not by any other important factor. Now let's, let's address that. Let's take a look at that. The income potential. Income is obviously what? Money coming in? But don't forget, income is also goodwill. It's also support. It's also all those good things that a business needs to expand and grow. And potential is possibility. How much is there to be made? by an organization. So we're taking a look at the income potential of any usual group. Well, how do we define a usual group as opposed to an unusual group? Well, usual means ordinary. Something that is commonplace. Unusual would be not ordinary or not commonplace. So a usual group would be one that would have to provide a very valuable service or product in exchange for the income and goodwill that it makes. An unusual group, by contrast, would be perhaps a government that is able to generate income through taxation whether or not a product is made or exchanged with its public. So if you're a business owner, you fit into the category of a usual group because you have to provide the highest quality products and services possible in your market to be able to generate enough exchange with your public so you can get money and income to come in and goodwill and support from your public. So when we take a look at the income potential of any usual group, which is a group that you participate in, it's going to be established. So what does established mean? 